Our company does injection molding, and uh, for injection molding you need tool and die. And tool and die is a trade which was very uh, successful 40, 50 years ago. And uh, then it basically died out because so many businesses moved to China and had all their molds built in China and their uh, plastic injection molding being done in China. So basically, as, as in my situation, I cannot find tool and die makers to build molds for new products. And so that is really um, holding my business growth back. So I started looking for alternatives and uh, actually was reaching out to high schools uh, here in, in the area and I was connected to the uh, 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 Snohomish School District and the Snohomish High School and learned that Snohomish High School and many other high schools in Snohomish County have a beautiful, uh, full equipped CNC machine shop. They have 3D CAD, they have 3D printing. So I was totally surprised finding that out and uh, learning that also the teachers who are in this environment have a hard time finding kids to operate these machines and, and finding kids to go through these programs. And the two reasons for that is that first of all, the kids are being told by their parents, no, 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 you don't want to go in manufacturing, that's bad. You want to go to a four-year college. Second, the uh, state has uh, such stringent requirements on the kids as far as passing grades, as far as being tested, that they really have no time to do these non-curriculum, so to speak, uh, programs and are afraid that they wouldn't be able to make it. So um, as far as I'm concerned, that's where we have to start. We have to start at the bottom. And when we do that, we when we try to get the kids into manufacturing, we certainly want to give them something other than a job. We want to give them a career.